Here I am, Dublin Airport, about to go to Berlin for my birthday. There's Clara. Hello. Uh, not too much. You're filming already? Are you? Hello. 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 Happy pre birthday. Thank you. Come on! Come! Ben saving the world one can at a time. Let's get in for a photo. Almost on our plane. Gonna have fun. Have a great time. What's up, <laughs> We're gonna have a great time. See you on the other side. Well, we are priority, so we got on first, but uh, poor Danny was left behind. I haven't been to bed yet. Ben hasn't been to bed yet. Here we are in lovely Berlin. It's lovely. It's a bit great. It's lovely. Hey, Ben, let's wait for Danny. Let's wait for Danny. Okay. While we're going to wait for Carla, we're going to go to a bar called Wunderbar. 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 Carla, Carla, talk to the camera. <laughs> I'm going to say hi, hello in German. You'll learn it one day. What is it? I don't know. <laughs> we'll figure it out. Look at her standing there getting her train ticket. Look at her getting her train like ticket. A like a wench. A train riding wench. <laughs> we'll find our way eventually. We're waiting for ages for our train to come. And. Okay. <laughs> So um, this train that came and was sitting here actually is our train. So we're going to Alexander Alexandra Strauss. Alexandrina Strauss. Alexandrina Strauss is what it's called. Yeah. This is the train. It's all very nice. And here we go. Yeah. Pose again. You got it. Well, we just got off the first train. We have to go and get the U-Bahn now. Um, Berlin has a lovely feel, it's kind of like industrial chic. Very nice, I like it. Scoff it, Ben, scoff it. Scoff that kebab. That's okay. We are in the supermarket now looking for alcohol. And it's so cheap. It's actually so, so, so cheap. It's kind of um, dangerous though, isn't it? What was that? It's kind of dangerous. I mean, look at the prices. Just gonna buy some uh, Twitter here. What's this in Berlin? Only some Kerry Gold. Ooh, Ireland's best. Yes, absolutely. We got the key to our Airbnb. Now, it's a loft apartment, so it's up six flights of stairs. That's gonna be fun drunk later on. Guys, you okay? No. Sweet home, sleeping home, attic, sweet attic. It's lovely. Is it nice? Is it lovely? So we left Danny and Ben to go and get some kit, and now here we are looking for some new clothes. Suddenly, dun dun dun. We are in Alexander Platz. Uh, it's a big shopping area. We came to get a few last minutes. We came to get a last few minutes bits and pieces. And there's a lovely dry fountain. So um, not only is it my birthday tomorrow, but it's also Carla's birthday today. Happy birthday, Carla! Yay. Happy birthday! About to head out to have a steak dinner for Carla's dinner. Yeah, Carla, so my dinner, my her, birthday. Her birthday dinner. <laughs> and then we're going to go to a place called Soho House. Yeah. Soho House. And then we don't know where. We'll we see. don't know. We'll see, see there's, 
there's no phones or photographs or videos allowed to be taken in Soa House because it's very uh. <laughs> 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 so uh, yeah. You gonna try sneak it in? No, I'm not gonna take video. That would be rude. <laughs> um, so yeah, we'll update you later on. Down 500 million flights of stairs. This is a cardio. <laughs> it just keeps on going. And going and going and going and going and going. Oh, we're down. The front we're going to is very, 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 very far away. It's up that big TV tower that I was at earlier on. Um, so we made a pit stop to get some uh, Jack Daniels. I got a Gordon's Dry gin and tonic. Yes, but he also, did. Oh yes, I will. Oh lordy. I really hope there's a lift. We're all going for food in the TV tower tonight because they're closed. It's too late. So maybe tomorrow for my birthday, but it's not Carla's birthday. But now we're going to a steakhouse. But Clara is a vegetarian. So you can't please everybody. Oh, she... She's vegan. How do you know someone's vegan? They'll tell you. They show that to you! Hello. Happy birthday to you. Okay, I may be a little bit drunk, but um, yeah, we just had some lovely steak, and uh, yeah, no, the lighting here is excellent. So here I am, enjoying the excellent lighting. Um, so yeah, so we're gonna go now and um, dance all of our steak off because we are full of steak. And it was beautiful. So we were walking to Zoe House. This is one of my favorite cities on earth. And then Carla told us after 20 minutes, oh wait, we're walking in the wrong direction. We'll it's over the other way. But we still get to see the beautiful sights, like the fucking tower. Look at that shit. I've seen it all night. <laughs> I just want to go to Soho House now, where we can't film, because it's all exclusive and VIP. But we're on there. Anyway, so, yeah, the girls are walking away. We were in Soho House. Berlin. Well, we still are. We still are. Yeah. But now we're allowed to use the phone. It was fine. Technically. Well, now I want to block. More nipple. More nipple. There we go. This is us. After our night out, um, we went to a place called Soho House and we were on the gas <laughs> It's my birthday! Woo! Woo! Let's Happy go see Paddy Bunny Day! Happy Paddy Day! It's Paddy's Day! Yay! Yeah, this is way more reasonable. I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> She's figuring out where we're going to go for dinner. Princess. We're going to go to Pinchy Princess! Pinchy No idea what that is. Um, <laughs> so yeah, we're going to go for food. Oh. We were up until 10 a.m. this morning singing, and now uh, we're just going out to see the Berlin Wall, but it's already after getting dark, so. I'm drinking Monster, and he has a microphone glass going over. I he wears his sunglasses <laughs> at night so he can get drunk and make a show of himself. <laughs> yeah, I get mad drunk, I fuck everything up, so I don't want people to see it. Yeah. Oh my god, thank you. Nobody wants to see those Nobody eyes. Saw that. Yeah. yeah, beautiful, beautiful, baby. Yeah. <laughs> we're going to see a wall, the Berlin Wall. Okay, so we're looking for the Berlin Wall. Oh, the remnants of it. The remnants of it, that doesn't exist anymore. We're still looking for the wall, but um, I think this is one of the guard towers. And these blue pipes must symbolize where the wall was. Um, it's pretty cool. The pipes go all the way along. Uh, I'm guessing the wall is going to be down that way, because we want to touch the piece of, piece of the wall. We'll see how we get on. We're kind of lost. That's it. That's the Berlin Wall. Wow. Wow. I'm touching the Berlin Wall.
Coming down pretty heavy now. That is the gate. What's the gate called again? Brandenburg. Brandenburg. Now we are going home to uh, have a few little aperitifs and get ourselves ready to go to dinner. We're going to go to Aperitif some. Aperitif is after. Oh, is it? Yeah, apre. Oh, apre. Apre uh, drinks. What do they call? Hors d'oeuvres. Hors d'oeuvres. No, hors yeah. d'oeuvres is from the sack. What's, 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 what's We're going to have some drinks. What's the pre drink? Called? <laughs> pre -drink. Yeah. Pre -drink. We're going to pre drink. We're going to pre drink. Do you know what this is? What is it? It's a milk and tuck. Ooh. Ooh. Mmm. Milk and tuck. Mmm. That is good. Mm. Really good. To you. Happy birthday to you. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, it's hot. Hey, there's a little Did you actually? Go on, pop that shit. Oh! Hey. <laughs> Carl is terrified. <laughs> to Paddy's day! I don't know the words. What do you say when words are not enough? Like a 20 minute walk to where we're going next. We're going to a karaoke bar, by the way. And um, we stopped off here to get some drinks. But uh, it's a drink shop, but also a musical instrument shop. Because, of course, if you're going to go for a bottle of wine or a few beers, of course you're going to buy a guitar. And condoms. She's mad for the condoms, this one. No, I'm just saying, it's like very rock and roll. There's like condoms, alcohol, and guitars. Ukuleles, that's not working. It's eligible. Tonight they have so multi-sexual yeah. box hopping. Multi-sexual box hopping is a great thing. It's, it's for the trisexual is people. It? You don't know what it is. It's for yeah. trisexual people that have fun with everybody. No. Multi-sexual box hopping. It needs to be encouraged. All the boxes are doable. Multi-sexual box hopping. It's a thing. Look it up. We've gone to a karaoke place that's like, it's huge! It's huge! But it's filled... Ow, how do you not feel that? I've got a strong threshold for pain. <laughs> it's a big karaoke place. You see what I'm saying? But now we are on um, our own little cabin. So we're all gonna sing there. Yeah. Sometimes I feel like I don't have a partner. Sometimes I feel like This sounds good, I love it, I
Okay, we woke up late and we're all very hungover. And now these guys, yeah. her and her. Hungover? I got hungover just right. He's still drunk. Uh, but they all have to go now. But I gotta be here for four more days on my own. Enjoy, enjoy. We're here for your birthday now, I don't know. Oh, no, Blippi. Enjoy, enjoy, lad. Um, I'm not gonna be the rest of the vlog. Thanks, don't get drunk. This vlog is gonna be just me and me, in. Just me. Bye. Love you guys. Bye. Love you. Everybody's left and now I'm on my own for the next few days in Berlin. Um, I am going to go and have some food. I didn't know what to do, but then this kebab stall here has queues going all the way down the street. I passed by it earlier on and um, yeah, according to the people, they say it's like a five-star review. It's like the best kebab in Berlin, so I'm going to try it. This is where Hitler made his big speech. What I'm walking through now is a memorial to the murdered Jews. It's all built to look like concentration camp um, buildings that they all lived in. Um, it's really, really kind of um, just a series of all these tunnels. Um, you could easily get lost in it. I think it's really important to stay respectful when you're walking around a place like this. At the moment I'm actually standing on Hitler's bunker, uh, which is now a car park. It's completely unmarked. There's no signs except for a little plaque over there. Um, yeah, this is where he spent his last days before he killed himself. Um, yeah, so there's no memorial, no nothing like, why would it be? But yeah, here I am, it's a car park. Hitler's bunker is now a car park. After they found it, they filled it in with sand and cement. Um, to kind of to stop anyone from ever going down there, I suppose, and kind of erase it uh, from history. So uh, yeah, here I am. Hitler's Hitler's bunker is a car park, and they found his body. They tried to bur like the Nazis tried to burn his body, and um, they actually partially burnt it. But then they found half of his body last year, and identified it through his dental records. Because reportedly he only had five teeth. There you go. There's your Hitler fact of the day. And now I am off to the Berlin Wall Memorial Museum. Um, it's supposed to be really interesting with lots of stories on how people escaped over the wall and got from East Berlin to West Berlin. So uh, yeah, go on, check it out. This right here is the Berlin Wall. Um, there's a wall on this side, then there's an expanse of about 50 meters where, that they call the death zone. Uh, that was filled with barbed wire and landmines and had armed guards and all that sort of stuff. And uh, if you could get through that 50 meters and onto the other wall and over the other wall, then you were safe and you were in West Berlin. Um, yeah, so this is it right here. There's pieces of it standing all over Berlin. Um, but uh, yeah, I've just been to the museum and it was really interesting and informative about how people escaped over the sides. Uh, really worth a watch and a visit if you ever get to Berlin. It was fascinating to see the stories of how people, you know, how they dug tunnels and how they were caught and then sent back and they were killed, but then like, other people made it. Um, some people like built hot air balloons to try and get over the thing. Uh, it's really, really fascinating. Uh, it's really interesting piece of history and time and um, we're checking out trip to Berlin well 
They all smoke in the pubs, so the pubs all smell of really stale cigarettes. Well, a lot of them do. But yet, the party never stops in this city. It's just it's crazy. It's constant. I kind of found it overwhelming at times. Uh, too many places to go, not enough time. And it's actually better to dress down. If you're dressed up in shoes and a shirt, you stand more of a chance of not getting into places, which is really strange. They're very much like all shades of everything here. And uh, it's kind of nice. Um, but yeah, it's different. Check it out if you get a chance. And uh, now I'm trying to make my way to the airport. And I actually bought some clothes on the last day, which I shouldn't have done. Because now I have to wear all my clothes because my bags are full. Yes. Might be cold outside, but Paddy's cozy. And that was a piece of Paddy in Berlin. If you got what you saw, don't forget to tune in for more pieces of Paddy. Um, yeah, but don't forget to like and subscribe as well. Peace, guys.